Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel again. Today I would like to show about uh, how to communication and backup the program uh, from PLC SLC uh, 500. Okay. Uh, before backup the program I would like to introduce some uh, hardware configuration of the PLC SLC uh, 500 okay so uh, this one we call the power supply that I already uh, turn on the power okay and uh, for this one, this terminal, uh, we can uh, input supply the voltage from 120 to 240 volt AC. Okay, this terminal. And uh, this is the CPU we can call the central processing unit okay and model 5 slash 04 CPU okay and this is the running status if it running it means that show the green lamp okay and this is the force signal if uh, we have forced the IO some force the IOs uh, it will show the yellow color Okay, and uh, FLT, this is the fall signal. If any IO or CPU is fall, it will show the green, sorry, red color of this one. And this one uh, for communication signal. And uh, for BATT, is the battery, battery signal. If the battery three inside here is very low it's low it will uh, show the red color okay and this is the RS232 communication signal if uh, commun communication uh, start it will show the green color okay and uh, this one is uh, the run mode when we select here it will run okay and this one is the remote mode I will uh, introduce again to this mode yes when, when we uh, create and test the program okay this is a program mode and this is the IO digital input module yes and this is the output and this is the fast input module for example uh, we need the counter fast counter we can use this one this module okay So uh, we will start communication to back up the program from CPU to uh, our software. Okay. So uh, first, I will connect the cable to uh, com to computer first. Okay. So let connect. Okay. And then uh, we will check the COM part first. Check the driver first. It uh, properly to use or not. Device manager, and then click it. Okay. So uh, right now we use COM three for communication between uh, 
computer and uh, PLC. Okay. So uh, let's go to uh, the software. First, uh, config here first. Uh, as Linux Classic. This software is used to uh, for communication between uh, the cable that we already connect to uh, PLC and uh, computer. Okay. So let right click and then run as administrator. Click yes. Okay, and then click uh, this button. This button is a cap ball, you see, the icon cap ball. It means that we connect, uh, we connect from computer out to uh, PLC. Okay, so click. And then uh, this is a blank driver Don't, uh, that uh, we not yet add any driver to here. So for add uh, the driver for communication, click here and then choose RS232 because we use RS232 and then uh, add new. For example, I choose the PLC. Okay. PLC 500 okay then uh, the COM port I will choose the COM3 for communication and then uh, I will click auto config okay it show like this it means that we can communication between uh, our software to the PLC Okay, and then click OK. Yes, it's running right now. Okay, so we can click close and minimize this one. So uh, we will uh, use one more software for backup the program from CPU. We call uh, AS Logic 200 English version. Okay, this one. So right click and then run as administrator and click yes. Okay. So uh, to back up the program, it means that uh, to upload the program from uh, PLC to computer click tool option and then uh, system communication and then click the driver driver that we already had before okay call uh, PLC uh, 500 okay click it and then choose this this is a driver node that we already uh, in insert yes so a b and then choose the upload button here so uh, i click upload in the child driver current version is not running driver is not running check again this is running running already right this is running already. Driver is not running. Oh, we might click uh, OK first. Who activate? Yes. This one is running, so uh, click OK. And then uh, apply. 
and click upload again okay it will uh, upload the program from PLC to our software right now okay for this is the program inside the software sorry inside the CPU that uh, uh, we already create before okay so uh, this we if we want to online check we click yes okay and then uh, this one we can switch the button for change the mode that I already discussed before uh, for mode we have uh, three mode right right now uh, I already connect to select to uh, program mode if we want to select to uh, remote mode just select here you see the program inside is the chain also and this is the run mode run mode if we click the run mode some program will be right okay so okay this is the run mode so we will check the IO configuration here the same as I uh, introduced already so uh, we use 9 slots 10 slots yes you see fast have two mo two modules and the layout has uh, three modules and uh, input has four modules okay so this is the the way that we use how to config or how to uh, upload the program from uh, PLC to keep inside the, our computer so save the program file save as and then uh, for example I keep in D so right click example uh, file save as example my document I will choose the new folder mm, for the SLC 500 upload Okay, PLC 1 and then click save and then uh, click yes okay so we can close our program so let's go to check the program that we uh, already saved SSC 500 upload why let's check again why we cannot save let uh, upload again so the backup is very important if the PLC will uh, for example burn or property damage so we can restore the program that we already backup we just change the hardware 
and then download the software is the okay our machine can run property okay if we don't have the backup we spend a lot of time to uh, re create the, the, the program again okay so very important for backup read the internal file uploading progress okay Okay, successful upload. Let's save again. Click save. Wait a moment because it uh, just working. Normally it not slow like this. Uh, maybe have some problem with the cable. I think. Okay, right now uh, we already sell. So let's go document and check again. Document check again. Why? Maybe uh, should be offline first before sale. Sale as again. Document upload. Okay. And then choose PLC uh, one. SLC. 500 okay let's check again okay file is already saved so we can close it so uh, this is the concept how to back up the program yes uh, so thank you very much for watching my video and uh, in the next video we will create some program and test with the hardware okay so uh, don't forget like comment and share my video to uh, get some uh, video that I will create the next time okay so thank you very much again and see you next videos bye bye